Hello. Today's assignment is going to be on page 19 in your String Basics book. Let me get my violin. I hope you've tuned up your instrument. You're ready to go. I'm going to be showing you this example on smart music. It's going to take a second just to get it to the right place. All right. So we're looking at number 91, the old gray goose. All right. Let's, and we know our D string notes, D, E, F, G. Let's see which of those notes are here in this song. We're going to do a little reading together. One, two, ready, go. F, two, F, E, D, two, D, four, E, two, E, E, F, E, D, four, F, two, F, E, D, two, D, D, E, D, E, F, D, two, rest, rest, repeat. Okay, so I saw F, I saw E, and I saw some D. So I don't see any G's in this song. There aren't any. So we're going to not use G today for this one. Fingers, E, one finger, F. Remember to add fingers and subtract fingers. Don't slide. That's an advanced thing. If you're playing cello, you're going to go D, E, and then three fingers for F. Okay. This song will start with two fingers on the D string. So first thing we should do is we're going to get ready to play. We're going to check our bow hold. You have a nice bow hold like mine? Make sure you do. Okay. I'm going to put my instrument up. I'm going to slide my hand back. And then because the first note is F, I'm going to set up with two fingers on the D string. Or if I'm a cello player, I'm going to put three fingers on the D string. And with all of that done, now I'm ready to start. goose and if you needed to always you can always slow it down get you into the smart music um now that song is known by another name i don't know if you know that that song is also called go tell aunt Rody," or what the song is actually about um the words go go tell aunt Rody, the old gray goose is dead mm, poor aunt Rody. she's got a beloved pet a farm animal that is now not with her anymore but a uh, good song to practice moving around with the D, E, and F fingers. And that's going to wrap up this short little lesson today. Um, and be well. I'll see you next time.